you know, people ask me, how do I balance, you know, my schedule and my career with my family? And of course, I don't think it's balanced at all. Um, but what I try to do, first and foremost, I want to be a good mother. Because I believe that all my patients can get another doctor, but my children can't get another mother. I'm it. So, as I look at my schedule of what I have to do and what's what, and you know, get my children's schedules of um, um, reading to the kids or going on a field trip, I try to figure out, okay, I can make this, but I might not be able to make that. And so I try to make what I can, schedule off when I can, and when I'm with my children, I am there 100%. I tell my secretaries, everyone else that's known me, if anybody, if my kids call, my family calls, I don't care where I am, you need to let me know. And that's been my mantra, and that's how I balance, if you call balance. Um, and when I have to write a paper or give a lecture, do research, whatever, it's on the weekends and when the kids are asleep. Uh, you just do what you have to do. And sometimes I'm 100% with the kids, sometimes I'm 100% with the operating room or the hospital, um, and sometimes I'm 100% doing nothing. That doesn't happen very often. <laughs> But I just try to, whatever I'm doing, give that my all at that time and try very hard not to feel guilty. Of course I do. Um, but um, one, one, one uh, funny story, I volunteered so much with my first son, my oldest son. Uh, I remember he was going to Galveston to look at the marshes and look at the different bugs and, you know, just the whole ecological society, you know, uh, with the marshes and everything in Galveston. And so I said, oh, son, I'm going to volunteer for the trip. I'll be a chaperone. And when I told my son, he said, oh, no, mom, all the chaperone spots are filled. I'm sorry, you can't go. Are you sure that, you know, she just, oh, no, mom, all the spots are taken. So after the trip, I remember talking with his teacher, oh, Miss Hill, Trey told me that there were no more uh, chaperone spots. Wow, what a good trip. He told you what? Of course you could have gone. So to me, that said that even though I feel guilty thinking I miss things, sometimes my children don't. They think I'm there all the time.